Benny Nitas might just have been the last one. Yes, she was, and they're off and running. In race one on the fifth day of the festival, the Tote Ireland Irish EBF Median Auction Tour will made over a mile, vying for the lead in these early stages, Spiritual Sun with on the inside Santiago prominent. They're being followed at the end of the first furlong by Bolly Bullard. Just behind them is Sunchart with Grey Surge next on the inside, being followed by Benny Nitas as they head down the far side. Royal Red Persian is next on the outside and then comes Condretti of Wave right across from the stands just outside the five furlong point and Santiago and Danica O'Brien have gone through on the inside to just head Spiritual Sun and Ronan Whelan they're tracked by Grey Surge and Shane Foley on the inside of Bolly Bullet and Rory Cleary as they head for the fourth and halfway stage Sun Chart next with Royal Red Persian and Benny Nitas and then comes First Thing with Condretti of Wave on the inside Impetuous is next with Ms Thompson out the back boat driven Heading for the approach to the straight, Crack Ella and Manhattan Dandy. Coming now to swing into the straight, struggling is Mustang Bullet. And that one well behind us, Santiago makes the bend into the straight. Three parts of a length to a length in front of Spiritual Sun, being followed by Sun Chart in between horses. Then Grey Surge and Bolly Bullet is on the outside of Benny Nitas. And in the middle of the track is first thing, but Santiago has kicked clear, racing down to the final furlong in the Tote Ireland Irish EBF Median Auction. Two year old maiden at Santiago, chased by. Sunchart, who's trying hard in second place, but Santiago's win here puts Donico O'Brien on level terms as regards the jockey's table.